So today we're going to be working on a plastic bumper cover and if you do any kind of auto body or refinishing repair you know exactly what this is. This is an OEM style aftermarket application front bumper cover. Um, all these bumper covers come sealed. We are actually going to be scuffing the sealer to ensure that we get a good quality paint job and adhesion in that good quality paint job. So and what we're going to use is a 400 grit equivalent to a 400 grit piece of sandpaper but this is actually like a 400 grit scotch bright pad which is nice and flexible so you can get in all your nooks, crannies and crevices um, of your bumper cover because these things can be a little complex to get in and all your edges and everything. And the reason why we're doing this is to ensure a really good quality paint job with really good adhesion. These scotch bright pads come in handy for a lot more things other than just scuffing bumpers. Um, you end up scuffing quarter panels, etc. with them. Basically any component on a car that's going to get painted, you can actually use these in the final stages of prep before paint. As you scuff these bumpers, you'll see the sealer kind of changes from almost like a dark gray to like a bluish gray. That kind of tells you that you've gotten those areas. If you don't scuff one of these bumpers, the chances of your paint failure are very high. So you're going to want to make sure and get in all nooks, crannies and crevices because these things do not hold paint unless they are prepped properly. So you're basically just looking for your area to be smooth, imperfection free and you're going to want to check this as you do it to make sure there's no imperfections in the sealer from the factory that provided the bumper as well. Sometimes there can and will be imperfections in the factory sealer. So you're just going to want to make sure that your whole entire surface has a good like clean scratch area surface on it for good paint adhesion. These bumpers are designed to be painted. They're not designed not to be painted. I mean, these things have to be prepped just like any other paintable surface on a vehicle. This all needs to be prepped thoroughly. All nooks, crannies, everything has to be taken care of just like you would prep any other component on a vehicle for paint. That'll just help reinsure that you get great paint adhesion sealer. After you're done scuffing this, you're going to want to clean it with a good surface prep and then go to a plastic adhesion promoter and then tack rag it and then you'll be ready for your final process of base coat and clear.